It can be said that the spirit of a bot copy website chatbot lives on Google Dialogflow, a sophisticated conversational design framework. But does that mean it's difficult to use? And what does it even look like to work in Dialogflow? The journey begins at cloud.google.com backslash Dialogflow. You must pass the first gate, the second gate, and the third gate to reach the trailhead of website chatbot enlightenment. Name your first bot. Next, bravely seek out the default welcome intent. Using a Google Assistant response type, compose your welcome message. Hey there, that works. Now add a suggestion chip that will appear as a button. Why use Dialogflow? Clear, concise messaging, it'll all make sense in a minute. Seek out the default fallback intent, for it is not the nature of a chatbot to know everything. Perfect. Now let's venture forth to add your first intent. An intent is simply a question or statement that you want your bot to respond to with intelligence and empathy. You must train your bot by adding a few ways users might ask the same question. The possible permutations are endless, but you only need to add a few because Dialogflow's machine learning fills in the gaps, as you will soon see. First, scroll down and add the response users will receive when they're matched to this intent. Let's also add a suggestion chip to make it easy for users to take action once they receive their answer. In your bot copy account, you can see how your Dialogflow spirit manifests in the flesh, so to speak. Look familiar? Here's a query we didn't even plan for, but the bot copy and dialogue flow stack is mighty. It knows what to do. And now, so do you.